That's it, ladies and gentlemen. Tripler. It's the last time you had a tripler, right? Uh, back on Guitar Gate. Let's move over here so you can put the screen up. Boom. Uh, David Allen Cusco Jr. from San Antonio, Texas. Hits me with a little Dead South Broken Cowboy. By the way, if you're new, this page is for my students at guitargate.com. If you take my lessons and courses, it's my life work. There's a dozen or so up there. This is my thank you. You get to pick what comes next on YouTube. So if you dig the vibe and you want to subscribe, first link in the description. He says, this band's such a unique sound and the individual layers of the song is very mesmerizing. The time breaks and the scales are just break. Give it a look. For you, sir, I shall do it. Let's hit the button. Well, hold, hold, full screen, bam. I'm such a sucker for it. All these. So where are we? We are in the neighborhood of A minor, my friends. Ooh. A little out. All right, so A minor. Uh, you got this. Five flat seven one E G A. Going to your six major chord. Sorry, flat six major chord, your F. Go to its relative major. It's A minor, it's relative major, C major. And then, even though we've been we've been Ging all day, we're gonna make this harmonic minor. We're gonna make our five chord E7. So that, my friends, means you gotta have a trusty old G sharp in there. Remember, that's the point of harmonic minor is to make your five chord, which wants to resolve to one, stronger, so you make the third major, G goes to G sharp, because that is the leading tone to A. Leading tone half step below the root where you're resolving to. That's why it works. Keep going. When I was a young man, I helped build this land, even though I I love these. I love these kinds of songs, right? You're painting the picture of some type of some type of history, American history. Um, you know, railroad, like building the family, like you know, the drinking and the gambling, all this. I'm such a sucker for it. She gave me a sign, no error, those damn voices until we had none. I, I am a broken cowboy. 
Smoking Cowboy. that note that changed that see if you can hear it now here's because this is the thing right so we're just outlining chords with a basic melodic structure here okay um keeping that boom doom they keep keeping that tempo the banjo just makes it pop i dig it but these little changes as an improviser or as someone who's coming up with parts if if you decide to make your five chord major or dominant right if you decide to do the harmonic minor thing the point of it, again, is to make the third of your five chord major. What that means is that the note one half step below your tonic, so A, G sharp, that is the third of your five chords. Remember that forever. Your seventh, your major seventh, is the third of your five chord. That is the most important note being played right now. And so it behooves you to point it out in your part, right? And it's just these little things that I want you to train your ear to listen for. Um, and like, even as a non-musician, you should be able to tell that right here, something changes. Right there. Yeah, that. I think I pointed at the wrong place there, but you get the idea. You should be able to hear it. What that is, is that is the one singular time in this song where you're playing something out of key and it's on purpose. It's to make your five chord major, right? So your G becomes G sharp and it's your leading tone here right away. It's like, where am I gonna go? To A, just point it out. Become an active listener. When you, when you hear things like this, that you're like, ooh, something important happened there, stop, rewind it. Figure it out, and most importantly, use basic theory to put words to it, okay? Because if you put words to it, like I just did, you can use it in other places. You'll, you'll inherently understand what that sound is, right? Because you can explain it to someone else. If you can explain it to yourself, you can explain it to someone else. Very important. Um, th this is like one of, the, one of the examples of all the fundamentals that I drill home in all my courses. <laughs> Very cool. Yeah. That right there. This is such simple stuff, but this is the stuff as guitar players we get a bad reputation for, though. Because we learn our part, we learn the chords, but we never really, we aren't known for really understanding melody well and why notes connect chords and why they work. We're just used to knowing our riff, right? This basic ascending run, right? Check it out. Starting on C, right? Because we're over our A minor chord, right? Now let's watch it go up. Go into E here, right? When the chord goes to F. So what is that? That is our major seven of F. So F major seven. Now, that gives us this super floaty sound, right? We're not playing the third, which makes the function of the chord, and we're not playing the root. We're playing right behind the root, a half step really creates this floating, hopeful, you know, sense of, oh my gosh, we're really going somewhere. The oppor the, 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 it's endless opportunities. Listen to it. Right? So you tease at the F, you go above and you come back down. So killer. 
Just, we're, we're continuing to go up the scale, okay? But now we're up to G here, over the C chord, which of course is our fifth. So now we're shooting for the fifth. So it's, again, we start with the minor third of our A chord, going to the major seventh of our flat six chord, F, to our fifth of our, um, of our, 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 uh, our C, right? And then, what do we have right there? There's the note, G sharp, the third of your five chord, leading tone, back to your one. There it is. Simple, basic. Man, I'm telling you, guitar players, one thing that I've, I've learned in all of my everything, teaching, playing, gigging, everything else, is that as guitar players, we're pretty good rhythm-wise. We're pretty good harmony-wise, but we're complete crap melody-wise. For the most part, because most of us learn playing riffs, and even when we learn songs, and even when we get really, really good, we just learn our parts. And especially for those of us that don't sing or play other instruments, we never really learn, we never learn to embrace melody. And melody is the answer to all of your questions. What do I play over this? What would work here? What, what is that person? Learn the melody to every song you learn, okay? Learn to improvise just like that, going up and down a scale, hunting the chord tones, toying around with it, chord tone, chord tone, chord tone, hammering a melody, and when the chord changes, something is out of key, right? Like that dominant five chord in a minor key. Find the note, the third that makes the function, the note that changed. Find that in your melody and you'll connect it. I'm telling you, the melody is the answer to all of your questions. Can't stress it enough. Living life in the fast lane Racing cars and robbing trains I thought I had it all Got the call. Hit me. My father's worst dream. My son went down. And the colors deceive me. Even he thought that was funny. Look at this. <laughs> He's like, yeah, it's, the, it's a little screw up. Dude, okay. 
Uh, Dead South, Broken Cowboy. I can dig it. Who sent me this again? David Allen Cusco Jr. from San Antonio, Texas. Thank you for being a subscriber on GuitarGate. Uh, thanks for taking my lessons and courses and for posting this um, on the React's request page. Um, I'm such a sucker for this style of music. I just dig it. Um, key takeaways, for sure. Uh, learn the melody. Learn the melody. It's the answer to all your questions. Um, I'm just going to leave it there. That's it, my friends. I love you all. Have a great day. And again, if you want to be like David and pick what comes next on YouTube, you do so as a thank you for taking my lessons and courses. I got about a dozen up there. It's my life's work. It's called GuitarGate. It's the first link in the description. I'd love to have you in the community. And that's it. Where should we go next? I want to know.